Bill allocation in transaction, which is mainly used to view the allocated details of the parties whose bill by bill option is enabled. So, here what we are doing is that bill allocation shows the receipt and payment voucher done on account reference type. So, I am viewing here the payment voucher. So, here I am setting the voucher number and just selected whether it's bank or cash. And if you want to add any party details, you just can make the new name, whether the which party it is and its opening balance you can give or if any enumeration has to be given, you can just give that. And if you want to add any new group, you just can press add button and just add new group as well. Or if it's already created, you just can select it from the drop down menu. And here I am just giving the opening balance and just selecting whether it's credit or debit. And if it's bill by option, that is given yes and it is enabled for that party. So it's given OK. And just moving on to the payment voucher section. Again back to and amount I'm giving out here. And I'm just pressing out the against button. And as you know, against button is enabled only when bill by bill option is enabled for the corresponding party. And here I'm just uh, taking the reference to on account. That is the main thing in it out here. And just selecting the currency and just giving the amount. And if check number is to be given, just give the check number. And check date if it has to be given, just give the check date. And on top we are selecting the date. And the voucher number is given and just select it. And if you want to just save it, you can see, under you can see the total and you can save the details. So after saving it, that just can go to transaction again. And you're just taking the next voucher, that is receipt voucher. Already I just told that the all account reference type you're selecting. And the receipt voucher, voucher number is selected and check whether it's bank or cash. I just selected cash and date is given. And account ledger, I just selecting the party and the against button I'm taking. And in the reference, I'm just taking the on account and voucher numbers can be given and amount can be set it and currency also can be set it. So I can see the total amount, just save it. So the details is given and the check number is to be filled, you can just fill that and under that you can see the total. And if you want to remove anything specifically, just select it and just press remove button. And if any narration has to be given, you can just give that and after all those, you can just save it successfully. So that's what is with the receipt voucher. Next what we are going to this, after all this purchase and receipt, we are going finally go to the bill allocation. So you can see all the details regarding the bill allocation one by one after that. And in the account group I am just selecting the party. So you can just search according to the party and you can just reset that, that is clearing. And according to the account ledger, you can just select it accordingly, you can search it accordingly and you can see the details. And here you can just make the addition by double clicking to that and just press update. So it will be updated.